Good afternoon, it's Fifty Shades of Green, I'm talking to Simon and Adam, say hello Adam. Hello. It's the 19th of April, it's a Wednesday, it's 2 o'clock, and the sun's been shining all day. Um, we just thought we'd uh, show you a few jobs we've been doing today. Um, first of all, Ad, what did you do first? We did... We uh, basically repotted on the uh, peas into yep, the main 30 litre containers. And that's it. Done a second sowing. Second sowing, basically for successional sowing. Brilliant, thank you. And then what we've done, uh, I've got Adam uh, just to do a bit of change around in the garden. I've moved the well, he hasn't got the archways over the door anymore. I've moved uh, one to the entrance of um, Adam. I'll show you in a minute to um, to the entrance to Gemma's garden. And then the other one's gone over to the fruit area anyway. And, and then we've moved the 30 litre racking to one side as well. We've moved the spare 30 litre racking to underneath my bedroom window, the bathroom window. Um, but what we've done, I've, we've filmed this and uh, I will uh, we'll go on to that. Uh, and then the last of all, or the second from last, um, we need... We've run out of growing space. <laughs> Anybody who knows, been watching me from the start. We started off in my garden. Then I uh, took the fence down and kidnapped the neighbour's garden. And now we've run out of growing space. So I'm going to put some more containers at the front. And Adam's going to show you in a minute uh, where they are going to go and what they are for. Then after that, we're just going to put through a bit of potting on or seed sowing. Uh, because we had a couple of failures uh, and I want to make sure I have got the amount of um, seeds I need or seedlings I need so um, no, without further ado join Adam in the greenhouse thank you very much see you in a bit hello and welcome back to 50 shades of green what we'll be doing today is potting on these uh, these peas now because they're more or less ready to go in so um, I shall crack on with it and start separating them. Uh, well, I wouldn't say separating them, but basically putting them round all the outside and then uh, start putting the uh, pyramid frame back in as well. So, basically, because these are really coming along nicely. And also, shortly as well, I shall be. Um, basically doing a lot of successional seeding with the other peas as well later on today so hopefully all being well now these will grow up ni grow nicely around the outside they all need uh, potting on seems a little dry the, the soil but hopefully they'll be quite alright to pot on. Rooting's looking perfect as well for them so a bit fiddly as you first put them in but uh, it should be fine. you can see some of them had three, four or even five in each of the pots so they're all growing up, growing nicely
So you've got a decent, decent hole for them to go into. And as you can see, the soil is all coming apart nicely. left to do so um, after this we'll just basically put some seeds into the next bucket to uh, sort out the basically direct sow into the second bucket See what I'm doing here. I might might probably get too much into the camera, so you can't see what I'm actually doing. So Now that's all of those in, I'll give them a good water in, put my frame back in. And hopefully they'll all grow around it as you can see. some peas here that will be directly sowing so we're uh, just scatter them directly on so hopefully what we'll do is we'll cover it all with a bit of compost and hopefully they'll go nicely just get the compost it's what you call successional sewing so when those are ready the ones that I've just done already will uh, have more and then in a few months time you'll probably pop more on yeah that's all done there make sure always compress the compost directly over the seeds because uh, then there's no air pockets when they get watered so um, that'll get watered now water for the seedlings and 
Right, so I'll probably be back shortly just to see what what our Simon needs me to do or the little jobs to do. So um, we'll be back shortly. Hi, we're back on Fifty Shades of Green. Just a bit of an update. We've moved an archway from main, the main door area because uh, he's going to be uh, putting 30 litre containers there for uh, his asparagus on there. Also, we've mo had to move the archway here from there over in between the two to, in between the two gardens now for basically growing the cucumber and aubergine. So the cucumber will grow over the aubergines, and um, also we've moved the 30 litre container bed in frame from from where it was with all the tomato we've still got a few strawberry plants on there at the moment but we've moved it basically underneath his bathroom window at the moment ready for his 30 litre containers basically we'll probably be putting carrots and the old peas to grow just underneath his bathroom window so uh, it's a bit of an update on what's been moved so uh, bear with and we'll be uh, right back hello we're back on 50 shades of green this is adam and uh, these are going to be future projects uh, underneath our next our next door neighbor's uh, bedroom window there'll be um, a new flower bed flower bed going underneath for uh, spring bulbs and summer perennials there i'll just uh, take you over to the next underneath the uh, next door's living room window the bench will be removed back into the back garden and uh, basically there'll be a mimic of the same design here that simon's got underneath his living room window it will basically be the same sort of design here and it'll be uh, all herb garden there growing all sorts of different types of herbs from there so uh, it's all future projects there for that one and uh, I'll just take you round and uh, basically now underneath uh, Simon's window here as you can see there's a few fir trees there and, and things but uh, here there'll be a new project starting there but it'll be coming soon so uh, that's a new project coming soon underneath his window so uh, We'll be right back in the next few minutes, so uh, uh, see you again soon. Alright, welcome back, we're in the house again. Um, we are just having a nice cup of tea uh, before we carry on. Um, what we're going to do, uh, we're going to plant some cucumbers. And what are they? They're the uh, telegraph. We've got some tele yeah, um, cucumbers and it's telegraph. So what Adam's going to do, he's going to put two pots, uh, he's already filled them and pressed it down. He's going to put three seeds in each, um, and then on the side, um, why do we put them on the side, Adam? So it stops them from uh, rotting, basically. Yeah. So yeah, we don't put them flat because they have a chance to rot, so that's brilliant. Uh, so he's going to put three in each pot, and then he's just going to rough the earth, the, the earth over. And um, and then give them a water, and and I'm gonna write the label as we speak. Um, so that's cucumber. And what is the date? It's the nineteenth of April today. Nineteenth of the fourth, two thousand and seventeen. Do you know what? Actually, that reminds me. It's been 37 years since me and Adam have been uh, friends for. Because we met each other, we, we, had, we became friends in middle school. No, in first school. Yeah. And then that was in uh, in 1981. So, seven, that, well, if you count it up, that's 37 years. that's cucumber and the date so what he's done he's covered them over and then he's going to give them water
Put it in. There you go. And then he's got a tray. To put them in. That's it. So that can be moved down there. So, what we're going to plant now, Adam? It's going to be the butternut squash. Oh, yeah. Again, we uh, this is my fault. I um, planted butternut squash in these Jiffy 7s. And um, they didn't turn out right. Um, I don't know if it was not, you know, or whatever. I don't know what it is. They're not, not even a sign. Not even a showing. It's been a couple of weeks now. So... Uh, to be on the safe side, we're going to plant plant uh, one of each seed in these um, three liter, sorry, three centimeter, eleven, sorry, three inch or eleven centimeter pots. Um, so uh, he's going to do one seed in each. So what I'll do is save your boring. To, job is bring it back when it's um when he's put them all in and we'll just label them up okay what this that right so he's uh got them all in and we're just about to put the label in button up squash then he's going to give them all good water so um they should come up a treat now rather than then the Jiffy 7s did work, but not for the bigger seeds, I don't think. Like beetroot, you know, worked a treat for the beetroot. Because it's not going to disturb the roots. But I don't think they're good enough for, like, squashes and pumpkins and stuff like that. Right, what we're planting now then, Adam? We're planting the uh, courgettes today, the uh, golden coloured tasty fruit. Uh, what's it? F. F. Atlanta? Is that a? Uh, it's F1 Atina. F1 Atina. So it's Atina with F1 variety. Atina. Gold. Uh, we had Black Beauties done, but I fancied a change. So we've got some golden ones. So we've got six pots. Um, we're just going to fill the last pot up again. We're going to put one seed in each pot and um, press it down and just rough it up. So it's pointless you watching this process. Let's go back when he's uh, nearly done. Right. So that's all six planted. And then all I've done is lay up the yellow courgette. It's easier than trying to spell a Tina. Um, but there you go. That's us. Done for this episode. Uh, you've watched another episode of 50 Shades of Green. Please comment, like, subscribe. Um, we have reached 250 subscribers. So we are at such a, a milestone. It's unbelievable. Uh, I didn't really uh, expect to even get that many subscribers. Um, well, we all say that, don't we? We all like to be heard, but no, not 250. I'm, uh, I am really grateful uh, for everybody um, who subscribed, new subscribers, their first subscriber, old subscriber. But uh, our 250 subscriber is... Um, ended up being yeah today it was um a gentleman you all know oh i've forgotten his name now but it's rafferty um 
Oh, I'll tell you next time. Uh, yeah, he's uh, he's the guy. He wears a uh, flat cap. Uh, and if you've been watching his videos, his latest video is he's digging out a um, a pond and using a bath as a, a nature pond. Uh, and he's uh, still uh, in between doing that and then digging his first digging. Uh, it's, yeah, he's been doing that lately. So, yeah, I've got 250 subscribers, so thank you very much. And uh, we'll catch you on the next video. Thank you very much. Cheers. See you. Bye-bye. Say bye-bye, Ad. Bye. -bye. bye.